Hello again YouTubers, uh, this is just a video of the loose things that I've picked up over the past week. Got some Matchbox, Hot Wheels, Corgi, Yap Ming in here. Uh, first off the bat, we've got this Kenworth. I don't know, it's some sort of drag truck, I should imagine. I should imagine. Speed truck, I don't know. Um, been getting into my matchbox just lately. This I know is missing a top piece, but if I can get one of them, the sticker is in relatively good condition. To say it's from, uh, it says 1967 on base, but I think it's from 80s. It is missing its tyre as well. Uh, AMX Javelin. Need to get this sticker off of here. But. It says it should have opening doors on internet that I've read, but it doesn't. I do have a green one that is exactly the same. It's got opening doors, so I don't know what's up with that. Uh, this <laughs> a Rollomatics uh, beach hopper. The little man. I don't know if you can see that, jumps about. That's some crazy lunatic. Again, matchbox. Uh, Escort XR3i Cabriolet Sweet You see these all the time growing up as a kid Well, not really a kid uh, Dragon Wheels I've now got one with A working Hinge inside I've got one that's broken uh, Citroen SM opening doors sort of a, a old school rally tempo on there pretty nice uh, BMW 323 yeah 323i Cabriolet I thought that at first was that and it was just a different colour when I got it home I had a bit of a shock nice to have it like, nice nice casting looks similar though I've got a AMX Stocker no, yeah AMX Pro Stocker it's pretty nice, they all need a bit of a clean up they were all 20 pence though, what are you going to say Chevy Van I've got a few of these, I quite like this casting Heavy. Uh, I don't even know what this is. A slingshot dragster. It's, it's pretty weird. I don't know if the wheels are supposed to turn like that, but maybe they're just broken. Weird to see the sticker still there as well. Intact. Uh, a greyhound shuttle bus, well, bus sort of thing. From Lesney, old school this one. I remember my brother having this. It were a lot battered than this though. I had to buy one that were in decent condition. And we've got a, a mod rod. It's got a, a Jaguar sticker on there. But then I also got another mod rod. But it's got your red wheels, which... Uh, can't explain it. I don't think they did used to do chase pieces back then. I'll have a look on internet later on when I get time, but for now. Uh, Hot Wheels Royal Flush. Orange. 33 on the hood. Pretty nice. Old red lines. Uh, black walls on it. Uh, Porsche 911. 95 on. Uh, Nissan 300ZX, which strangely for a Hot Wheels has opening doors. I know this were a first edition. Must have just realised that it cost a bit too much to make opening doors and opted out of it. Uh, yeah. Volkswagen Golf, two seconds cake, GTI. Uh, can't actually remember what this one's called, but 
it's really, really heavy casting. Old school black walls on there. And a uh, Datsun Z Wiz. I wish the tampo was in a bit better condition. I don't know if you can see that, but that is green with red, which apparently is the rarer than the green with orange. But it has got a plastic base, which is odd. And then I did pick up this, an original red line Diora, 20 pence. It, obviously, it's got its surfboards missing, but if it had its surfboards missing I would, I would have been ecstatic but that will go in my red line collection I'm going to do a video later on about the red lines that I've got uh, a Yat Ming Pontiac Firebird with opening doors two Corgi Supervans no now the interesting thing about this super van is Hot Wheels actually used this exact same casting for a super van for theirs that it had a Hot Wheels logo on and stuff. I don't know if they borrowed it from Corgi or Corgi borrowed it this from them, but it is literally exactly the same casting from even from the bottom where it says Corgi, they've just scrubbed it out and replaced it with Hot Wheels uh, and finally today I picked up this for a pound a Hot Wheels steering rig it does work it's just uh, not gonna work on this uh, there you go pretty cool but that were a pound and I just thought I'd uh, show this for you enjoy and uh, happy collecting